Hi everybody, this is Phil Kerner, the Tool and Die Guy, and tonight we're going to uh, go over how to accurately measure the depth of a keyway on a shaft. It's February 10th, 2025. Let's get started. So I've got this little drawing here, and a uh, very simple shaft, nine and a half inches long. Uh, what do we got here for a diameter? 990 to 995. They came out about 994 to me. But what I have to do is machine this shaft right, or this keyway. 253 to 258. 253 thousandths to 258 thousandths. No big deal. And they want it 135 thousandths deep to 138 thousandths deep. So the big question here is, uh, the width is no problem, how to measure the depth, all right? So uh, this is what it looks like after I've machined it. I use all of my capabilities to do that, right? Uh, just a simple slot. But how are we going to measure the depth? Well, you really can't put a pair of depth mics on here and kind of get them straight on a round shaft. It, it doesn't work, all right? So uh, go through the uh, archives here in the toolbox, found a nice piece of uh, uh, key stock, quarter-inch key stock. And it's cold roll, so it's about a thousandths under each way. 249 by 249, all right? Probably see where I'm going here. You guys are smart. All right. Let's just lay that right into that shaft, all right? This is just a block I had laying around and just happened to hold the part right. So now I've laid that in there, all right? Now I could put a dowel pin in there, but it's kind of hard sometimes to measure over two rounds, all right? So I, the flat I like better, all right? So uh, let's move along. Simple calculation. There's my 994 diameter shaft. There's my 135 thousandths depth. There's my 249 thousandths thick Key stock, one inch 108. Uh, I have three thousandths on this. 135 could go to 138. If I choose to make it three thousandths deeper, that's going to reduce that to one inch 105. Okay, so simple calculation. Uh, how, how we do here? Looks like I'm about one inch, uh, one inch 105 and a half. We're good to go. So it's a nice solid measurement. Very happy with that. Uh, very simple deal. So, you know, there's a reason you keep a box, a little key stock and things around. And this is why. This is a great way to measure it. So, um, hope that helps. Just a quick, simple in and out tip tonight. We'll see you on the next video. I'm Phil Kerner, the Tool and Die Guy.